our school has a great topic for a book study this school year to help us in meeting our student achievement targets. What we need now is a way to keep everyone organized and learning collaboratively. We are going to see how teams can help drive the success of our professional learning community. We log into our Office 365 account and click on the Teams app. Then, to create our PLC team, we clicked on Add Team at the bottom left corner of our Teams portal. We chose to name our PLC 6th grade PLC since our entire group of 6th grade teachers will be working together. We also set this PLC to private since we are going to be sharing our students' test scores with each other. Whether we are meeting in person or virtually, it is important to get our meeting set. There are two easy ways to meet with people using Teams. When you click on Meetings, you have the opportunity to set a meeting and the invite looks very much like setting a calendar meeting in Outlook. In fact, it will appear in my Outlook calendar. If you want to brainstorm additional topics for the PLC meeting with a co-leader, you can talk to them immediately using Meet Now. Whoever is online and free to join can jump in on the conversation. You know they are online by the small green circle with the check mark at the bottom corner of their picture or name icon. Our PLC debated on how to manage the files and information we would need. We could use the files part of our PLC team, but we elected to use the integrated PLC OneNote notebook because it has templates already created and it is based on the Dufour model for PLCs. As we locate great articles, we post them for all to consider. We also keep meeting notes as we cover topics from our book study. This is also another great place for us to easily access student data through the Power BI app. PLC conversations now carry on long after our formal meetings, since we started leaving comments as we work through new information. I don't know how we ever managed our PLCs before we had all these amazing tools with Teams.